Hi everybody, uh, this is Joe. Um, I'm going to go over uh, go over what it took for parts and what it took to uh, get my GoPro as an FPV back to this monitor. So when I, I am flying it, I can kind of see what's going on. Uh, the first thing I got was the uh, transmitter. It's for the GoPro. It's the Hobby Ace uh, Light L250. Uh, it's a, a 5.8 gigahertz, 250 milliwatt uh, transmitter for the GoPro. Uh, I got that. It plugs right into the side. Very simple. Uh, the other thing I got was I found out I didn't have enough room with the standard mount that comes with my Kirsten. The, the, the thing sets the other way and it, there wasn't enough room between here and there. So uh, from eBay I found a, uh, it's called a standard body frame, which is this black uh, holder, more, more or less for the uh, for the GoPro and it was only uh, like four bucks and all that and it had the the, uh, the space on the, on the side to plug everything in it worked really good the only thing is uh, the plastic a little thinner th than these so I put uh, some black tape on each side just a little one piece and it, it tightened it up and it, it worked fine uh, the, the other thing I, I had to do was uh, get a, a 90 here and uh, because uh, uh, it was hitting the ground so uh, for the antenna so I got the um, it's called a RP SMA male to RP SMA female right angle connector adapter and I put of course put that there and I also got the extender cable here which is an uh, it's an 8 inch uh, 20 uh, uh, centimeter mil to female uh, RP uh, S, uh, MA extender cable uh, that uh, would plug uh, straight into there and it goes down to my antenna here uh, the, the other thing I got was my uh, the clover leaf antennas uh, one for this and then one for the uh, receiver here uh, uh, this does not come with an antenna so you do have to buy one uh, those are uh, called clover leaf antennas. Uh, the other thing I got, of course, was my receiver. I got the uh, FPV uh, 5.8, the RC. Uh, it's the 5808. Uh, you can get that either from eBay or Amazon, wherever you, you want to buy it from. So that was another thing. The other thing I had to buy was the connector so I can plug a regular LiPo battery in, which is one of these, more or less. So I got the uh, the adapter here, and that, these are uh, connectors are XT60, uh, and then the small connector that plugs in, into this is a uh, JST connector. So I'm going to put this all in the notes below and all that, so um, all the descriptions and all that, so you, you want to uh, search like I did. Um, let's see what else. Yeah, and the clover leaves I already went over. The other thing um, I got, they say the 250 um, milliamp batteries are, are supposed to be good for uh, an hour or hour and a half of fly time or transmitting time on, on this thing, but I found that not to be true, so I went ahead and got the 800 milliamp batteries, and I just um, Velcroed them underneath here, and they plug straight into here. And these have the, um, uh, see what connector is this, it's an X5SC uh, connector, uh, these little little things here, so that's uh, what we had to do to get that to go. Um, ba basically just, you know, plug this in, I got my antenna on here, uh, Velcro this here, and all you do is uh, basically, there's channels on here, you can see on uh, check uh, YouTube and uh, there's a lot of uh, videos out there to tell you how to uh, program it if you need to but uh, these just plug straight in here and then you gotta plug your battery uh, in for your uh, uh, receiver and this is just a, 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 a fill a world uh, 7 inch monitor and it should come on here in a minute. And there you go. 
don't know if you can see that very good or not, but uh, it works uh, fine. So anyways, that was that. The, the other thing I got too was these are the standard chargers that come with the Kirsten, and it takes about three hours to charge one of these batteries up. So it takes a long time. So I went ahead and got um, one of these chargers. They're, they're a LiPo balance charger. Uh, this one's uh, made by IMAX. There's a couple different brands out there. But uh, I got this, and, and it charges up in about an hour. You can also do multiple um, multiple charging of, of batteries with the uh, balance charger uh, plate, which is one of these. And I also had to buy the uh, connectors here. But uh, also, if you get the charger too, it does not come with the uh, AC adapter. So I had to buy one of those. I'll put that in the description below. So you got to get. I got that, and then uh, they won't charge up these batteries either, the, the little ones for the uh, uh, transmitter. So I got one of uh, these with like ten bucks, not bad. And I also put this in the description below. And then it does not come with these connectors that you need to uh, charge your batteries up that plug into uh, the side here. One end goes there, and then you plug this in here, and then the other end plugs into um, here, or if you're using the balance charger, you, you do them in series on that. So anyways, so you have to buy these too. The, the other thing I got that made it kind of a little easier is these things, especially when they're new, they're really hard to pull apart. And I got this little thing from uh, Hobby King, which is, I think they're out of England. And they're uh, an easy off plug disconnector uh, system. I'll put that in the uh, description. It's for the uh, XT60 connectors, which these are. And basically, you put these little clips on, on each of these. I ended up gluing these on, but you can pull them off after you glue them if you get, you get a bad battery or something. So you kind of waste them. But you just slip this in there, and it, it easily disconnects them. I, handy little tool. It wasn't that much. It was uh, four bucks for the, uh, the thing. So not bad. Um, see what else did I uh, get? Yeah, uh, th these are uh, uh, Dean plug to the, uh, these are Dean plugs. You can buy them with these on uh, the plates with these already on there. If, if you have the uh, XT60 uh, connectors, you can buy them or you can get them with a the Dean plug and then uh, plug these on. And I got a multiples and I can do multiples at one time. The other thing I did was I got the uh, Phantom self-tightening um, uh, uh, props um, for it. It, it. The uplifts a, a lot faster and all that. It, it makes it a lot faster. The, the original ones are, are quite a bit smaller, as you can see. And uh, it just seems to fly a little better. The only, only thing is when it's coming down, it seems to uh, do a little, a little shaking down. But... Otherwise, I, I really like these. They, they also make a, a set for the um, the Kirsten too. You can either use the Phantom or, or the Kirsten or Cheerstons. I'm sorry. Uh, they're all self-typing. Uh, one thing you got to remember though is they come in sets uh, two, so you need four. So you got to buy two sets. It's a uh, uh, right and left, kind of clockwise and uh, counterclockwise uh, props you need to get. So. Uh, and then, of course, you got to get your LiPo batteries, and depending on, on your uh, drone, you, what ones you're going to get for that, too, of course. Um, mine takes a, a 27 milliamp battery. It lasts about, I don't know, about 10, 15 minutes uh, flight time with all this on there. Uh, the, my next video, I'm, I think I'm going to uh, do would be, um, I'm going to put the, um, the gimbal on. And I'll go through what it took me to get the gimbal going and all that. And we'll also fly it and see how much, uh, you know, with the added weight, how much time it's going to uh, take off. The other thing I did try, which didn't really kind of work, was I, I wanted to put the, uh, the, the, the receiver on this and, and then, of course, have the monitor up here instead of using the tripod. But by time, and then, you know, I, I got the little fiberglass thing, I tried it. But that's kind of a heavy camera or a monitor with the battery and all that. And it was just kind of, it was just cumbersome. I was trying to fall off and all that. So I didn't like it. For now, I think I'm going to continue using that. I might try a better one later on, but not right now. Anyways, um, 
that's all I have to go over for right now. Like I said, I'll put everything in the notes below so you don't have to do the searching I did for hours trying to find everything I need or you get something in like this and you don't realize it doesn't come with the charger or the AC adapter so you gotta go buy that so it's just try to save you a little time and, and uh, 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 you know uh, searching for uh, everything you're gonna need probably to get started here so thanks for watching and um, I'll probably uh, do another video and uh, talk to you soon thank you